is now. I look really weird because I realised that I didn't put eye mascara on very well. I didn't curl my eyelashes. I didn't put eyebrows on. Didn't do my eyebrows. That's the um, phrase I was looking for. It's actually Tuesday at like 2 o'clock. I don't think I've filmed very much recently just because I haven't really had the chance. I've been like doing lots and lots of bits and pieces like work. Um, yes, like the whole of Sunday I was just doing work and and in the afternoon I had to go and see Jack and then the evening I went and saw Sarah. Yesterday um, I literally got here, did my, um, went to like all of my like, lectures and stuff, got back and then didn't really do much to do. Did I do a little bit of work? I might have done a little bit of work. Um, and then Today I went to my, I went with Antonio to the doctors and then I came back here to go to my lecture, went to my lecture, then I came back to do work, I had lunch and then I came here yeah, to do some work and I thought actually I will try and set up my printer but to connect because the Wi-Fi is obviously edgy Rome so my printer wants to connect to edgy Rome um, but it won't let it because the network uses an unsupported type of authentication or encryption so that's good fun so I'm gonna just try and search for an Ethernet port in my printer otherwise that was a waste of like 40 quid I will probably keep you updated oh, later on in the week and tonight. Um, later I'm going to have a look around Winchester College Boat Club to like view it for Rang Society. So that should be fun. Alright, see ya. Hey! <laughs> Becca's here, she's getting ready. Uh, it's Bot, it's Wednesday. I haven't filmed anything today because I got up quite late and uh, I went to town with Chelsea. Got loads of bits and pieces. Now we're just getting ready and pre drinking for Bot. Excuse my messy bed. I wouldn't say it's nice, I mean, okay. just go and have a scoop of that, okay. but like it's not awful. Right, whose go is it? Mine? One. Have I done this before? What, what? No, this, this shot. Don't think so. It tastes like absinthe. Does it taste like... You know the absinthe one? we had? Yeah. Yeah, you know when Sophie gave us that weird... Oh, no, 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 it tastes oh, like... I like uh, that. It tastes like absinthe. Oh, you know, that was a good
guys, it's Saturday, it's 2 o'clock in the afternoon and I've been up since half past nine but I've just been like on YouTube the whole time and I had like the weirdest dream last night well it wasn't even last night, it was like after my alarm so it was like this morning technically because I have like seven alarms set um, it was like this baby was floating along in like a folded up pop-up tent along the road and I was like oh I should pick this baby up because you know it's just been abandoned in this tent. And then all of a sudden there was this like girl baby, and when I say like, like the boy baby who was like in the tent, he was like like eight months old. I don't know. Like, he was like an older baby. And then um, this like girl baby who must have been like maybe like two months old or something. Like it was like proper like newborn, like really young was just like down like a lane or something like I just found these two random abandoned babies and I was like um yeah I'm gonna pick that one up as well so I was just carrying these two babies down the road I kept like bumping into people and like, oh why have you got those babies I was like oh well they're abandoned so I'm just gonna take them to the doctors apparently that's a logical thing to do um and just see what happens um yeah so I did that I was like walking and, and then all of a sudden I was like almost like in the stock room of where I used to work at Clark's and I was like uh who are all these people I don't know who, who you are like obviously they were like new people who work there even though no new people work there um and I was like hi and they were like um hi what are you doing here I was like I'm just it's just a shortcut to the doctors I'm just going to um, like give these babies in because they've just been like abandoned and they were like oh but it's a Sunday and I'm like oh so the doctors are shut great woo don't know what to do now I went into Sarah's because obviously she has a child so I was like oh maybe they're crying because they need their nappy change I was like, oh, I'll go in there on the way to the doctor's. I was just rambling about this dream, but it really weirded me out. I woke up and I was like, what the fuck was that dream? Um, yeah, so I walked in there, but Sarah wasn't there, just her mum was. And I was like, yeah, um, so these babies were just abandoned on the street. And then that's when I bumped into some random person who just started changing the male baby's nappy. Um... Yeah, and then I like made it into town, blah, blah, blah. I was just like walking around with these babies and then I woke up. It was weird. Like it was like just after I realised that I wouldn't be able to take the doctors when I woke up and it was half nine and I was like, ah. Well, weird. But yeah, um, I've just uploaded last week's vlog. It's a bit late, but you know, at least it's up there now. Um, I need to edit the vlog for tomorrow so there'll be like two vlogs going up this weekend oh, i really need to do all of my work as well but i just cannot be bothered i'm so exhausted this week it just seems to have been really busy and because it's like rainy and cold and autumny it's just like i just want to be tucked up in bed so that's pretty much what i'm doing today i might do some work like just on my laptop in bed later on but i don't know but I might catch up with you later. I've just spoken to the camera for five minutes, mostly about my journey.